peace, infinite waters diving deep once again. The power of words. I want. I want, I want, give me it, give me it, I want, this word want. And I'm just realizing how we use this word want when we talk about things in our everyday lives and really how it impacts us on a deeper level. When we say I want this, I want that. In my mind, essentially it is telling the body or telling our minds that we don't have it. So essentially we are living in a state of lack when really and truly abundance is our natural state. So more and more in my own journey, I've just began to remove that word want from my vocabulary because it's a useless word in my mind because a lot of the time when we say I want something, it is sending a signal out to the universe to say we don't have it. So that already makes us feel inadequate it makes us it brings discomfort into our body into our minds because we feel that we don't have it so it makes us always long for something it makes us struggle it makes us enjoy the struggle it makes us feel uneasy and it makes us lazy sometimes when we say i want to become the best piano player in the world Instead of wanting to become the best piano player in the world, why not just become the best piano player in the world? Because then we put our words into actions. Because essentially, <laughs> a lot of us, when we're saying, I want all the time, it's I want, it's the separation, it's the division, which creates a lot of agony for so many of us. So for me, a lot of the times, it helps to visualize because imagination is key. It makes me empowered when I visualize that I already have everything I want. Oh, this is the secret nonsense. No, this is not about the secret. <laughs> this is about realizing that our own power of imagination and visualization to realize that we have all those things that we want already. If we can really just imagine that, then a lot of our woes will disappear because whenever we say we want something we almost put ourselves into this state of if I don't get this then it's all over we give ourselves an ultimatum and that can be dangerous when we say if I don't get this watch which I really want then my whole life is going to end when really and truly it's not going to end and for me that's it i just remove that word want because even in a lot of cultures i think even in uh, chinese language want and think is the same word and it just is amazing because whenever we want something we're thinking we're thinking too much instead of allowing things to flow and being this is it the power of words i want to enjoy the sun no i'm going to enjoy the sun Peace, infinite waters diving deep. Peace.